Straight leg kicks. Lock them out, kick them up. I got the idea from this workout I saw online. I thought it was a kind of a cool rep scheme, you know. One gets a little bit easier, but the other one gets a little bit harder. So we'll see how it goes. It's a little more reps than we normally do, but I'm sure we're gonna get a, a good high intensity workout in, in a short amount of time. Grab the knee, full drop, alternate. Going. I just ate breakfast, so hopefully I don't throw up. <laughs> Still burping. Grab the heel, hug the knee. A little bit of balance here. Try to get that knee up. You feel this in your glutes. This is a great stretch. If you're tight, if your hips are tight, or you sit down all day. Stretch, slightly lean forward. Feel this in the front. Wide stance, side lunge. Go as low as you can, focus on that inner thigh stretch. Some of you can't go that low, some of you are right here, that's okay. With each stretch, go a little bit lower. Focus on the inner thigh, we're really spreading the legs apart here. It's a really important stretch, you don't want to get injured. Nothing worse than tweaking your groin. We're going to need a weight today, so if you have a weight, grab one. You can use a water jug, laundry detergent, a heavy book, your dog, your baby. Oh, I'm not your baby. <laughs> but, you know, any, any weight you can hold with two hands. If you don't have a weight, that's okay too. Just move along with us. I'm sure you can substitute the exercises for something else. But they're pretty basic exercises. They're not that difficult. It's just that we're going to get tired and the rep scheme is going to add up. So, Alright, straighten out. Grab the foot. Rotate up. Grab the foot. Rotate up. You want to really twist your spine here. Open up your chest to the sky. Try to keep your legs straight. Lock out your knees. You feel some pops in your back? That's good. Stretch it out. Exhale, twist. Big step back, you're on your toes, back foot, arms up, five reps, Lunge straight down. All right, that's five, switch it up. You're on your toe, your back foot, arms up, five reps. Full range of motion. Push-up position, bring your right leg outside your right hand, right arm up. Get your elbow as close as you can to the ground, and then right back up. Keep your back leg straight. Lock out your back leg. Make sure you look up. And hold, max rotation. Switch side. Left leg up, left arm up, elbow down, right back up, five reps. Every time go a little bit lower, sink that elbow down, lock out your back leg. Last one, hold. Deep squats. Fix my shorts here. Keep riding up. Alright. Leg straight. Grab the toe. From here, you're gonna fold into the squat. 
Try to get your, your torso as upright as possible. And then using your strength, lift your arms and stand, squeeze your glutes. Toes, legs straight, fold into the squat. Arms up, stand. Toes, remember your toes, uh, your knees are on the outside, your arms are on the inside. Use your strength to lift your arms up. You should feel a lot of tension in your upper back. Last one, hold it at the bottom. I want you to drive your elbows into your knees, creating space. Get your torso upright, rock side to side, loosening up your ankles. My right one is a little bit tighter, so I'm gonna lean on my right one. You can cheat a little bit by putting your hands down if you're, if you're having trouble, like you feel like you're gonna fall back. But it's really important to always try to do a deep squat. We never do deep squats anymore because of the chairs and even, even the toilet seat has been raised for us. So don't ever forget, we were animals that used to do deep squats all the time. Jumping jacks, three, two, one. Elbows up, keep that torso as upright as possible, drive your knees out. Three, two, one. Squeeze your butt at the top. Last one, hold. Keep that chest up, keep that back upright. And up, shake it off. All right, we got our pyramid workout. One is gonna start at 10, the other one starts at one. The first exercise is gonna go all the way down to one, so from 10 to one. The second exercise gets harder, it goes from one to 10. All right, the first two we got is sit-ups and push-ups. So we all know what a sit-up is. All right, so bend your knees, tap up, sit up, right, real basic. On the push-up, a couple different things you can do because you might get tired, you might have to go down to an easier version. So I'm gonna start from the easiest progression, which is a negative knee, all right? So slowly down, one, two, three. You're gonna cheat back up, kind of like a child's pose. Get back over your hands, one, two, three. Rest your chest, all right? Progression from that one is a full knee, all the way down, all the way up. The progression from that one is a full negative, positive knee. So watch, I drop my knees and then I do a positive. And then from there, you have the full. Make sure your elbows are tight to your body, okay? You're not out here. Elbows are tight, you're gonna pull your shoulders down and you gotta make sure your butt is up, not down here. You don't wanna do a push up like this. You don't wanna round it back. You wanna be there, okay? So sit ups to push up. First one is 10 sit ups one push-up, and then we go nine sit-ups, two push-ups. All right, here we go. Let's see how long this first one takes. All right, 10, one, in three, two, one, 10 sit-ups, go. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One push up. Here we go. Ready? One. All right. Nine sit ups. Nine sit ups. Go. One.
do this to me now, music. Seven sit-ups, go. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Four push-ups. Here we go. One. Two. Three, four, six, sit ups, go. One, two, three, four, we're back. Five, six, five push ups, here we go. Three, two, go. Good workout. All right, cool. What up, Melissa? 
How you been? The analyst. What's up, dude? How are you? Woo! All right, looking good. Looking good. We're gonna do thruster and swings. All right. You're gonna need to wait for this one. A couple of ways we can do the thruster and the swing too. If you're holding two weights, even better. <laughs> you're right, Jackie. We've done worse. <laughs> We've done worse. Okay, watch. We only have one weight. Here's the thruster. Elbows are under the weight. You squat from here in one motion. Thrust. Okay, so squat. Use the momentum from the squat to thrust up. So that's your thruster. Swing is swinging through the legs and then snap your hips up. All right, as you come to this position, your back is straight, right? You're not rounded, your back is straight. You're gonna drive through your hips really aggressively. Boom, and snap them up, boom. All right, you wanna use momentum on the swing, okay? Thruster swings. We start with thruster, 10 reps, one swing. Here we go. All right, 10 thrusters. In three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, one swing, here we go. Three, two, one. I would never stop like I'm running from the top. Down. Nine thrusters. Here we go. Take a deep breath. Three, two, one. Exhale up. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Nine, two swings, two swings, ready, set, go. Five, ready, set, go. 
If you get tired with the burpees, I want you to go down to the easier version, right? So a full burpee is all the way down, right? Chest down, jump up, hands up. When you start getting tired, modify, okay? Don't bring the chest down, hands back, jump to push up, and then jump back up, right? Easier version than that is a step back. Step, step, jump, jump, okay? So if you start getting tired, you do that. Now, everyone does a squat check. Squat, arm, legs are wide, jump into a narrow stance, just like a jumping jack. All right, that's our squat jack. So, 10 burpees, one squat jack, you know the rest. Here we go. Start that jam again, because it's so good. Not that one. All right, here we go. Ready, set, go! One! 
Oak. In retrospect, probably should have started with the squat jack and ended with the burpee. But it was okay, we got through it. The first part of that, that round was tough, but as we kept going, thank God we did less burpees. All right, we got one more, guys. This one's gonna be shorter, so don't go anywhere. Get your water, breathe. All right, this one's focused more on abs, more on core. Can barely move, wow, <laughs> I know. Fernando, what up? All right, this is the next two. We got bear jump and body crunch. So, here's the bear jump. You're gonna keep the knee right under the hip. You're gonna bring the knees an inch off the ground. You're gonna jump to a push up, jump back to bear crawl. Not too far forward, always back to bear crawl, okay? These are called bear jumps, okay? Second exercise is gonna be a body crunch. On your back, start in a ball, open up your arms and legs, and then crunch. Lift your head, point your toes, crunch. All right, let's start at six five. Six five, and then we'll work our way down. All right, bear jump six, body crunch five. Here we go. Bear crawl position. Six reps, here we go. Knees off the ground, three, two, one. Back, up, one, back. Up, two, three, four, five, six. All right, five body crunches. Ready? Point your toes. Three, two, one. Open, crunch. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, oops, excuse me. Five bear jumps. Ready? Knees right under the hip. Here we go, three, two, one, jump, one, two, three, four, five, six body crunches, six, ready, three, two, one, go, one, two, three, four, five, six, woo, four bear jumps, four, Ready, go. One, two, three, four, seven. Seven body crunches, ready. Three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, three, three bear jumps, we're almost there. Ready, go. One, two, three. Oh yeah, eight, eight body crunches. Ready, set, go. Exhale, crunch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this sucks. Two, two bear jumps. Ready, go. One, two. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're almost there. Nine, nine body crunches. Take a deep breath. Ready, point your toes. Go. One, two, three. Last round, guys, last round. 
And that's your pyramid workout. Great job, guys. Be proud of yourself. That wasn't easy. All right, don't go anywhere. We're going to stretch really quick. And now you can start your 4th of July weekend. Try not to get too drunk. <laughs> Try not to eat so much food. Even though you probably are. I know I will. But the way I make myself feel better is I try to do a quick workout. At least in the morning. You'll be amazed. By just doing a, a quick little workout in the morning, you put yourself in a deficit so that when you eat all the food and you drink all the alcohol, of course you're going to gain body fat over the weekend, but because you put yourself in a deficit, starting Monday, you're not too bad. All right, great job today, guys. Here we go, quick little stretch and you guys are out of here. Legs straight, arms up, inhale. Exhale, collapse. Oh, my abs are on fire. Oh, that was good. Deep breath. Not bad, I like that workout. Constantly challenge yourself. Butterfly stretch. You wanna keep your body guessing. Never get comfortable. And also that means changing your weights. If you use the same weights every time, you're just gonna get used to it, you're not gonna grow. So don't be afraid to lift heavier weight. Especially you ladies, trust me, you're not gonna get muscles. It takes a lot of discipline. I've been trying my whole life. <laughs> so don't be scared to lift heavy weights because you're gonna get too muscular. On your back, right leg up, pretzel stretch. Deep breath. Switch. Deep breath. All right, legs down, bring your left knee across your body. Left arm away. Inhale slowly, exhale slowly. Switch. Exhale slowly. On your stomach. Butterfly stretch. Hands next to your chest. Rise up, squeeze your glutes. Pull the shoulders away from the ears. Breathe. Child's pose, sit on your heels, head down, three deep breaths here. Close your eyes. Slowly up, take a big lunge forward, drive your hips down, arms up, breathe. Squeeze your glutes here. Switch side. Big lunge forward. Arms up. Squeeze your glutes. Downward dog. Hands head in between your arms. Bend one knee, push on the straight leg. Switch, 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 walk hands to feet, legs together, just hang, take a deep breath, slowly curl your body up, squeeze your glutes, arms up, inhale, Exhale to the side, inhale, exhale other side, and down. Great job guys, happy 4th, enjoy your weekend, do something fun. I know the beaches are closed, restaurants are closed, bars are closed, well some of them. But you know this is good, this is going to force you to improvise and do something different, right? Maybe go to a park.
park, maybe rent a kayak or a paddleboard, you know, maybe stay at home and paint, you know, figure it out, do something fun, do something different, do something that, you know, you've been thinking about for a while, but you haven't gone around to do it, so, love you guys, have a good weekend, I will see you Monday, same time. I don't know, I think the burpees first was better. Glad you do less as they get more tired. Yes, I agree, Mike. I agree. It was good the way we did it. Happy 4th, happy 4th. Peace out, guys. Love you. See you Monday.